Knowing how to use your cane the right way can help keep you stable and safe. When you use any sort of walking aid, like a crutch, cane, or walker, there are a few important things to do that will help you get ready and get going. First, you need to get ready. Work with your doctor to make sure your cane is the right type and the right size for you. Check that the rubber foot is in good condition and replace it if you need to. You can get a special foot for icy conditions in winter, but avoid slippery, wet, or icy conditions when you can. Which hand you hold your cane in makes a difference. If you're using a cane because one leg is weak or painful, hold the cane on the opposite side from the weak leg. If you're using a cane for a little balance and stability, you can hold it in the hand you'd use less. Now you can get going. Here's how to use your cane on a level surface. Hold the cane close to your body so you can push straight down on it. Then set the cane comfortably in front of you so it's even with the foot you are stepping with. Don't lean forward to reach farther. Then step past the cane with your other foot. Walk with your cane just like you're taking normal steps, moving the cane when you would normally swing your arm forward. You move the cane at the same time as the opposite leg. If you're using the cane because of a painful or weak leg, move that leg at the same time you move the cane. That's all there is to it. Here's how to use your cane on curbs or stairs. Be sure to have someone with you until you feel safe and steady using your cane. Stand near the edge of the curb or stair and get your balance. If you're going up, step up with your strong leg first. Then bring the cane and your weak leg up to meet it. If you're going down, move the cane down first, then step down with your weak leg and bring your strong leg down to meet it. When you reach the level surface, get your balance again before you start walking. Remember, up with the good and down with the bad to help you lead with the correct leg. If you're using stairs that have a sturdy banister or rail, hold the banister with one hand and use your cane in the other hand. Remember, when you walk, Always look straight ahead and not down at your feet. And be on the lookout for things that could make you trip or fall. Things like pets, kids, rugs, or cords. Never use your cane to help you stand up or sit down. Instead, keep it close so it's easy to reach. Then put your hands on the sitting surface or arms of the chair to guide you as you slowly stand up or sit down. By learning how to use your cane the right way, you can move forward knowing you're doing all you can to stay stable and safe.